Okay, so what we're doing here today is a channeled meditation with transmission. And what I'm going to do is welcome in um, whoever is here to talk with us. Um, sometimes uh, it can be hard to get their name. Sometimes that takes a little bit of time. So just bear with me. Um, but what I'll do is I will lead us into the meditation and then we'll just open to whoever is there. Does anybody have a question before we get started? Um, if you haven't watched these before, let me give you a little background. I have a few of these up on YouTube that you can watch. Um, what we're, and I realize that this might be totally new for some of you. Um, what I'm doing is connecting to beings such as angelics. Um, or others who uh, have who are high vibrational and beneficial and have our highest interest at heart and have a message to share with us. And when they come through, because they carry such high vibration, anything that comes through from them transmits that frequency. Now, some channelings are specifically about frequency, like the frequency attunements that I do, that I'm doing three days a week. Those are with angelics, and those are all about the frequency transmission. That's all about raising vibration. When we do these channelings, this is more about a message coming through. Um, it can be about the frequency, but often it's more about the presence that's coming in and the message that they have for us, even though frequency, frequency still will be transmitted. So um, I know it gets a little bit confusing with the different types of channelings and um, what the difference is between them. I also do the channeled healing sessions, which are a different type of channeling. And in those, it's all about healing. So the focus is, is what we pay attention to. The focus in the channeled healings is on your healing, the healing of the people who are present. The focus in today's channeling is more on the message that's coming through, but it'll also be the meditation. So we sit, so we'll have the message and then we'll sit until I get the uh, message from the guides that we're complete. So that part is a, a part where frequency is coming through, you are being worked on, so stay open to that. Um, yeah, and I will tell you at the end, I'll, I'll ask how many beings were with us. Often it's more than just one, uh, usually quite a few. I'll ask how many, and then um, if I can get more information about who they are, I'll let you know. Um, yeah, and then it, so in terms of just focus, the frequency attunements that we do are all about attuning your system to higher frequencies so that you raise vibration. All right, so let's get started. <clears throat> and we're just going to settle in. So this is just settling into meditation. You can do this however you like. Following the breath. I like to turn my attention to the breath, use the breath as an anchor to bring me into the present moment, especially if my thoughts start to wander. Taking a break out of your day. Allowing yourself to become fully present, feeling the weight of your body. Feeling your feet connected to the floor. Clearing the thoughts, the worries, the concerns, the to-do lists, and making space to be fully present. And following the breath in and out. And as you go into the meditation, you don't need to do anything in particular. Just allow and stay open to receiving. So allowing your awareness to expand around you. 
while staying present and grounded. And opening to higher insights, to higher guidance, to higher beings who have your highest good at heart. And setting that intention now to only receive from those beings who have your highest good at heart. I'm going to open now to see who is here with us today, who is coming through with a message today. And today we have Archangel Uriel with us. Feel yourselves light. Feel yourself lifted. Do not be so weighed down by the problems you perceive in the world and in your life. Know that these are transient things, yet your lightness is of permanence in this life, in this reality. Your lightness is always available to you should you choose it. You may wish to float away. You may wish to fly like a bird, to soar above all of the difficulties that you experience and express and perceive in your world. There is peace in your heart. There is a peaceful place for you to rest within the heart, in the center of the heart. Bring your awareness now into the center of your heart. Feel 
feel where this resides in you. Do not be concerned with the exact location, yet feel where your heart center is. Feel the expansion now in this space of the heart. Where do you feel this? This is not a lesson in precision, it is a lesson in perceiving. When you call up the energy of your heart, Where do you feel this? Go now to the center of this space. Bring your awareness into this heart center. You may feel a warmth. You may feel a light. You may hear sounds. You may see colors. There is no correct experience of your heart. Observe what is present in this heart space. Who do you become? when you move into the heart. You may decorate your heart space in any way that you choose.
What does your heart ask of you? It is here within this heart that you will know your soul. It is here that you will know your truth. It is here that you are at your greatest expression, your strongest, most glorious, most light-filled expression. It is here that you are radiant and your radiance can be felt by all around you. And this radiance is carried on the words that come from the heart, the expressions of the heart. This radiance is known in every cell of your being. So often you live your lives without fully expressing, without fully stepping into, without fully becoming your full radiance. Do not be concerned with the thoughts of others. Do not be concerned with how this will be received. For in this state, you will never fully become who you have come to this plane to become, to express. Envision your lives as a fully expressed heart being. Do you see yourself in the same way? Do you see the same person in the mirror? You will find that what you express is reflected back to you from the hearts of others. You will find that when you allow your heart to be expressed, you also allow the expression of the other.
And you are to live a life of peace. This is attainable for you. It is a question of expression.
And you all can bring yourselves back. Come back slowly, take your time. Becoming aware of your body in the space, the weight of your body. Slowly moving fingers, toes, shoulders. Bringing back all of that good feeling back with you. Don't separate from it. Remember, be aware of the transition and that you can bring all of that back with you. Nice open heart. nice message reminder to open our hearts to stay in that heart space to allow ourselves to express fully from the heart and not hold back ah good to hear Pern you're welcome oh good Christy Liz yeah it is such a soothing presence Uriel Uriel represents peace and it brings this serenity whenever it comes in. Um, and thank you for joining me. It was lovely to share that time.